ransomed from pointless living. <laughs> Hello. You've been ransomed from pointless living. Has anybody been on Facebook lately? <laughs> this is not the confessional, just a, just a question. Look at that. There's only one and a half of us out here who spend any time at all on Facebook. Facebook is not a vain conversation zone where that's all that exists, but you certainly don't have to look very far or very hard to find some empty living going on, do you? In fact, a large chunk of the social transactions on Facebook are either crying about how empty my life is or, well, praising and rejoicing in how empty my life is. They're either celebrating the bizarre, empty ridiculousness of my life or bemoaning the bizarre, empty ridiculous of my ridiculousness. Is, is this not, am I the only one who notices that or is that not a good deal of what the social interaction is? Either I'm so sad because my life is so empty and useless or <laughs> look how empty and useless my life is. <laughs> and that... And don't go telling people my pastor said Facebook is of the devil. That's not. But the point is, apparently, a good many of these people are acutely aware of how empty, how vain their conversation, their lifestyle is. But we've been redeemed from that. We've been ransomed from that. That doesn't own us anymore. The empty days are over. That those days of sitting and wondering, why am I here? Why am I here? They're over. We don't have to live that way anymore.